What's up, everyone? Nintendo Man here, and my channel's back. Um, I got my phone back and all that. Um, I don't have my games right now, but I'm here to start a brand new series. Now, um, I have a channel day coming soon. I'll show you how the big update goes because the big update is happening. More content is not fully done, but I'm already ready. I'll do some and stuff. Dot Films is still going on. Level 9 Random Challenge for Super Smash Bros. is done, though. Um, however, Here's the new series, Character vs. Character. I'm going to do multiple videos talking about each of the characters and their series of their game. And so it's been. And I'm only going to choose two characters that have something in common with each other. And today is Kirby vs. Yoshi. Now, I got some voters to help me to, on site to point it, but those votes don't affect the video, however. Now, I want Professor Tate to vote, but he did not vote yet. However, I'll tell you if you voted yet or not. So either way, that means we have two votes for Kirby and Yoshi, and one for Yoshi, one for Kirby. One for our friend Luis, also known as the Luis Luigi, and for our friend Brianna. Uh, they're both subscribers to our channel. Thank you very much for voting. Now, it's kind of tied, so that means we do need to settle. Who's better? Well, in this video, oh, well, I'm going to do four videos, or six videos. Anyway, in this video, we're going to talk about Yoshi. In the next video, we'll talk about Kirby, and then we'll start talking about other stuff in opposite order. Anyway, so let's get back to Yoshi and talk about his abilities and what he can do as, you know, uh -huh. Either way, here we go. First of all, Yoshi's main ability, uh-uh. Well, actually, wait a minute. What am I doing? I should start off on telling you how Yoshi and Kirby are, are compared. Well, for one, they eat enemies. They can eat enemies and use them to their advantage in uh, some way, you know? Of course, I know what those ways are, it's just that I'm not going to mention Super, uh -uh, Kirby or uh, Super Mario Kirby Yoshi yet. They also seem to be the cutest characters that uh -uh, Nintendo has came up with, pretty much. You know what I mean? Either way, so yeah, they're very hungry and they like to be cute. Either way, let's go talk about Yoshi. For one, Yoshi eats his enemies by sticking his tongue out like a frog and swallowing them. Of course, Yoshi usually spit, um, poops them out into an egg. Which he then used to use against other enemies or solve puzzles and all that crap. And it was in Yoshi's new island, Yoshi apparently could eat a giant, massive shy guy and get a giant egg. So obviously, Yoshi can eat way more than Kirby. We got that down. I don't know how it's possible, but it is. Anyway, how much time are we at? We're at three minutes so far. That's good, right? I'm glad to be back on the channel. Anyways, um, either way, next I want to talk about how Yo uh, Yoshi's partnership with Mario. And technically, I'm not too, I'm not too much of a fan of it, actually, to be honest. But it's because Mario, how it uh, Mario treats Yoshi. How you can easily jump Yoshi into a pit just to get some extra height. Nintendo work on the jumps and gaps in Mario games. Plus, Yoshi can't do that whole, um, uh, um, egg thing in Mario series. It said, Yo um, when Yoshi eats an enemy that he can't use for anything else, he swallows it. Of course, one thing about uh, Yoshi compared to Mario is Yoshi's stomp is way more powerful than Mario's. Imagine the Koopa Troopa. Mario stomps on it and goes into his shell. Yoshi stomps on Koopa Troopa, the Koopa Troopa's dead. That is powerful. The Yoshi Lee just destroys the Koopa shell and the Koopa himself. I mean, seriously, all Mario does is scare it. Now that's power. And for one, Yoshi would probably make a great babysitter, I mean, seriously. Yoshi, he's like, look, the main thing about the Yoshi series is all about Yoshi getting Baby Mario back to Baby Luigi and all that. Though on Yoshi's Island DS, it's not just Baby Mario, you also have Baby Peach, Baby DK, and I think Baby Wario. I have finished that last one yet, but once I get my games back, I plan on continuing it if I can. I've been having trouble on 3 dash one um, I'm gonna tell you about it in the channel update, who knows. Um, why I cannot finish Yoshi's on DS for the heck of it. Um, either way, we're also gonna take you some more guys. But either way, back to Yoshi. Yoshi is Yoshi. And also, he got his own yarn game. Though, it is also made, um, though it was made by the same creators Kirby's Epic Yarn. The good thing is, Yoshi's Willy World is not like Kirby's Epic Yarn. Yoshi has the same abilities as, uh, so has the same everyday abilities. 
And of course, he has a health bar. Kirby's Epic Yard, Kirby was invincible, and it had a completely different play style from regular Kirby games. And when I mean you can't die, I mean if you fall, an angel saves you. Yes, I just said if you fall, an angel saves you. That makes no sense. Anyways, that's all I'm also about Yoshi. Anyway, I better get to talk about Kirby, but if you want um, any more suggestions on who's better, Yoshi or Kirby, you tell me in the comments below, if you want to, that is. And I hope I can get more views on the channel. Please continue the series, and it doesn't matter who's better, Kirby or Yoshi. We need to settle the debate now. I'm just giving you information to feed off of. Anyway, don't forget to listen to the Kirby video before you even make your votes, though, okay? Anyway, see you all. Peace, gamers. Yo!